are live in ATL with the amazing pair of links. We are doing uh, alter ego photo shoot for yours truly, Melanie Fiona. Come over here. Basically, she's going to be representing. Um, her alter ego is kind of representing all, all about her. So it's going to show the different sides of her, her music. And it's kind of like a protest for real music. So we're going to do it like either in a Senate or Capitol or something like that. trying to get across the bridge campaign that I've been trying to do through my music. Just showing all the positive concepts and reasons that music is positive. The alter ego photo shoot is like a dream come true for me because I feel like I'm so many different people inside of this body truly and just just the different things that I feel that the music and, and me as an artist represents it's just great to be able to have visuals. Hey I'm Kayla Prello and we're here with Miss Melanie Fiona and Derek Langston. Hi Miss Melanie Hey I'm ready. more about what the whole idea between my music, the connection between my music and me as an artist and the way I want to connect with people. Time to rock the boat. We just did the second look, which is the voter. Um, it's just showing her personality as a voter. And still keeping, still keeping um, everything consistent. I feel like my album can't really be classified. It appeals to a lot of different um, you know, genre listeners. Okay. Because it's based on soul music, it's mixed with R&B, hip hop, rock, right. reggae, pop. Right. So, you know, for me, it, it, it was just trying to make an album that would appeal to as many people as possible. We are doing the hot girl that is not an object. Representing the fight for women to have the right to be sexy and classy and not objectified. to open for him before I had even had a single on the radio, okay. definitely an album even close right. to put out the stores. Right. So, um, you know, he, he invited me to go off tour just based off of hearing the music alone because we never met each other. Right. And it was uh, it was the best experience, performing experience for me really because, oh, so, <laughs> I love Kanye. Like, I've, I always said I wanted to work with him. So really? when I got invited to open for him on tour, I mean, I went from being working on my album to like opening for 15, 20,000 people a night. My debut album, The Bridge, released this year, and uh, you know it's definitely a body of work that blends a lot of different genres of music together. You know, different genders and, and, and age groups and cultures and things like that. Yeah. Be sure of what you want to do. Uh, you know, definitely have a have a clear plan of who you are as an artist and what it is that you want to say, what you want to represent. And you know, if you believe in that, that's true to who you are. Go for it and never stop, because. Um, you know, people won't try to change you if you insist on being who you are.